Hey guys, it's Jason with Kentucky Sustainable Living. Uh, I was going to do a quick video, show you some of the progress we're doing. We've got a lot of woods out in our pasture and a lot of trees. We're wanting to create, uh, for a lack of, I guess we'll go with the permaculture term of silvo pasture, which essentially that's where you still keep some of your trees, but you thin everything out to where more sunlight can get in. I want to set the camera up to where you can kind of see when I'm running a bobcat and some stuff like that. But essentially the woods are so dense, there's just not, especially in summertime, there's no uh, light getting in there where you can grow anything and the pasture just honestly sucks. So what I planned, I marked a bunch of trees. I came out yesterday and cut a bunch of those. I'm going to take the bobcat and start pushing them in a pile. Any of the bigger stuff I can use for firewood. I've already logged those out and I'll push them up to where I can pick them up with a bobcat here in just a little while and put them, take them down to the other part of the place uh, to where I can cut them up later. But uh, I'll shoot a little bit of video and let y'all watch it and watch the bobcat run.
right guys it's Jason back here I've been working the last few hours on taking these trees and uh, some stuff that I cut down the other day uh, I've spent probably three three four hours something like that on a bobcat uh, got everything pushed up in two piles probably gonna burn that uh, might burn that stuff tomorrow I don't really know it's supposed to rain we'll see if it'll burn or not but we might wait a month or so uh, when it's real good and wet and everything i'll flip the camera around and kind of walk around and you can see some of the stuff that we've done all right there's a pile of brush that we pushed up uh right there and you can kind of see there's a bunch of rock outcroppings there's really nothing you can do with that uh i'll probably go in and thin a few more of the trees out but it's just so stinking rocky up in there there's no way to disc it or do anything like that uh and you can see there's a shop, a barn and everything. And then some of the other stuff that I've done uh, on up through here, you can kind of see that. We'll walk on through a little bit. But yeah, back over in there, like I said, it's just all kind of rock and everything else. There's a few more trees I'll take out. But just the stuff that I've taken out has really opened everything up already to where more sunlight can get in. We'll walk kind of up to the top of the hill and you can get a little bit of an overview. There's a decent shot and an overview of the stuff I've taken out and kind of worked up a little bit. Now, here's another paddock that I've been working on. We've got temporary electric fence strung through to break this pasture up. We took out quite a few trees. What's in forward in you had a bunch of cedar trees. I'm still probably going to take a few more out just to open it up a little bit more. There's a burn pile. There's another pile that we got pushed up. Going to burn it pretty soon. And you can see it's a lot more open than it was before so hopefully we'll get a lot more light in here and get get a lot more stuff growing and i probably do need to take a few more trees out but i like having the trees to screen because we've got a school right behind us and i don't want to cut everything down And I like to keep some of the cedar trees because the sheep and the cows have a nice barn, nice dry barn for them. But you can come out here in the nastiest weather and the stupid things are laying underneath the cedar trees. But you can see this spot where I'm at right now is pretty open. There's a lot of sunlight out in here. I'm going to get in here, work this just a little bit and uh, seed everything probably pretty soon is what I'd like to. And like I said, I probably need to thin some more trees out, but I like to have the trees. It just makes everything a lot nicer than having just bare grass growing out here. 